You are all here for a reason. That reason is talent. Some of you were born with it. Some of you have worked your whole entire life to achieve it. We don't care where you got it. We want you to bring it. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Hip Hop High. with Lisa, the professional organizer of the Hudson Valley and around the world. Hi Lisa. Hi Tamika. Nice to see you. Nice to see you too. I hear that you're going to help us get organized for all of us back to school parents <laughs> that are um, really, really, really dreading going back to school um, and getting ready for the kids. So I hope you can help me and help everyone else. Absolutely. That's my goal at walk-in and day like Yes, this. I love that. And it just yes. looks really, really nice. So again, Very it's nice. just a way to be stylish. Some of my busy parents use this in the kitchen for school papers, and when company comes, they just put it in the cabinet. Yes, let me see that. I love this <laughs> right here. See? I Very really nice. love this. Did everyone see this? <laughs> great. It's great. This works. I'll take three of these. Okay, good. Please, okay? <laughs> Because I am also a realtor, and I would have this in my car. See? Okay. I love it. But again, it's, it's small, nice. so it's not going to carry your entire filing system, but no, it's a portable right. system. Just a day-to-day -day basis. Exactly. Correct. That's right. really nice. And okay. people always ask me, you know, is there something that I can carry around with me right. and still look stylish without having a heavy briefcase? Right, yes. That's your answer. Thank you. and we're going to talk to him a little bit about his organization. Okay, Latinos Unidos, um, we started in 2001, a um, group of four of us, um, Peter Gonzalez, Richard Rivera, the president, Carmen Vasquez Tell, and Angel Figueroa, sitting around a kitchen table. We felt that we really needed something in this community to help people out, and especially the... Now, Peter, what has motivated you to stay here in Newburgh and um, help with the tough city here? <laughs> well, I taught in the city here. I taught in now, the Now, one thing I'm interested in, is it just the Latino community that you're helping, or are, is anyone able to come through the doors and assist, get help from you? Anyone come to the door. Anyone. Before anyone who calls started, up here. I was speaking with Peter Gonzalez myself and asking him um, questions about voting in the community and how we can engage um, everyone from Latin descent so they can understand the voting process and getting registered to vote and how important that is. And Peter said he had also been um, out in the community and helping people get registered over the years, so we really appreciate that also. Right. Fiber optic pin, we're the first ones to get it. You heard it here on the path <laughs> <laughs> at 280 Broadway, Newburgh, New York. <laughs> and welcome back to the path. You're here with your host, Tamika Williams, and I'm going to tell you a little bit about henna and what henna is, okay? Um, have you ever wondered, you know, when you see people with the tattoos and the paintings along their hands, along their arms, along their backs, you know, a little hint on the shoulder. Some people have it on their ankle and also along their walking to get a temporary tattoo uh, of whatever you like. Many of them do tell stories. There's all different type of artwork. Or you Watch our feature with Arthur Mitchell on henna. 